Welcome back everyone. I'm here again with SBR contributor Dave Golkov and today he's going to provide us with his top two NHL picks of the day. How you doing today, Dave? I'm doing pretty good. All righty, man. Let's start with the Toronto Maple Leafs going up against the Detroit Red Wings. Now, this is a rivalry match that you're recommending a bet on the over. Um, you, I think that you're expecting to see plenty of goals, but what factors did you actually consider before you made this uh, bet, you know, or before recommending this bet? Yeah, I mean, you take a look at the Toronto Maple Leafs. They have, uh, have scored four goals or more, and I believe it is six straight games. Their offense is playing pretty well right now. I mean, when, whenever the Leafs are winning, it's, it's related to their offense. It's clicking right now. You take a look at Detroit. This is a team that's actually, you know, entering today. Detroit is at the top of the Eastern Conference, if you can believe that. But uh, that aside, one of the reasons why Detroit's playing so well is the offense has woken up scored 2.7 goals per game in October. Uh, that went up to 3.29 in November, which was the fifth best number in the league. And so far this month, they're scoring three and a half goals per game. Uh, Leafs, you know, again, they're not a defensive team, uh, giving up three goals per game themselves, going up against a pretty good offense with Detroit. Uh, and the Leafs are bringing their decent offense to Detroit. I think uh, over is the play that makes the most sense here. All right, now the last one that we have here is the Edmonton Oilers going up against the Anaheim Ducks. Um, here you have another recommendation on the over. Uh, why do you think that we're going to see a little bit more than five and a half goals for this match, man? Yeah, I do like the over. Anytime you're taking a look at an Oilers game, you're looking at uh, a high-scoring affair. Just because their defense isn't that good, gave up five goals yesterday to the San Jose Sharks, allowing 3.33 on the year. And on the flip side, you see them playing an Anaheim Ducks team that's known for offense, is a team that typically scores well. Uh, even without Corey Perry in the lineup, uh, I still like the Ducks to score in that neighborhood of three, four goals. As for the Oilers, we'll need a pair from them. And uh, I think we get it. Frederick Anderson, 895, save percentage this month for the Ducks. Uh, he's given up 21 goals in his last six games. I think you factor those two things together and we get an over in this game. All right, good stuff, Dave. Thanks a lot for all the insights, man, and we'll talk some more hockey again tomorrow. Okay. Take care, man. And for SBR Picks, this is Dax Floyd. The SBR Network offers free sports picks and game breakdowns. Big money free betting contests year-round, a real-time Vegas-style odds monitoring service, and much more. So come see for yourself. To stay updated on SBR news and promotions, follow us on Twitter, Facebook and Google+. And do be sure to subscribe to the Sportsbook Review YouTube channel to catch all our daily sports shows.